So for here they have two for seven. And this one is my favorite flavor. And you always have to read the back to make sure it's vegan. So this one's not, so we're gonna put it back. <laughs> they have a sale for almond milk. It's only $2.69. And normally I would get this, but I just got almond milk, so I wish I would have like came here first. But people think that Whole Foods is expensive, but sometimes they do have a good deal. So I'm kind of tempted to get ice cream right now because they have the two for six. And these are two of my favorite flavors. It's Ben and Jerry's PB Cookie Non-Dairy and Fudge Brownie Non-Dairy. So I want that um, with like the hamburger. And they're all good. And you can put it in the toaster. I try to try like everything. I think for the most part I have tried everything. So my favorite vegan like meat brand is Gardini has a whole bunch of this while I've been here. I basically tried every single thing um, except I haven't tried this one yet, the sweet and sour pork this bite, so I think I'm gonna try this one. I'm eating nut free and I love bananas. I think I might get this. I mostly come to Foods for things that I can't get other places. So Whole Foods has a whole bunch of vegan cheese. So whenever I'm going vegan cheese, I come here. Dye is my favorite brand. A lot of people say they don't like the taste, but I feel like once you put it, once you cook it in your food, like it just it tastes like cheese. I don't know why. People like it. So I usually get the. <laughs> I usually get the cheddar ones or the mozzarella ones because I like to make vegan pizza. Um, so I always get tofu. So that's like a staple. And this is my favorite mayo in the whole entire world. This is chipotle eggless mayo. And if you read the back, it says egg free, soy free, gluten free. Um, it's vegan, it has no um, actual eggs in it. It's just made from mainly sunflower oil and aquafaba, which is the liquid when you get a, chi a can of chickpeas and you pour out the liquid, that's aquafaba. So that's what it's doing. Um, sausages. So we're getting it to eat with breakfast. And I don't think I've had the Mexican chipotle once. I also have like no desire to because <laughs> I make my own tofu scramble so I don't understand why I need it. You know what I be doing when they have when I see that they have a sale, I take a picture on my phone in case they try to play me at the register. So I recommend doing that. I did want to make um tacos or burritos. Foods has a good deal on their beans. A lot of their beans are only 79 cents, so I always try to get beans from here. And they are um, the 365 brand. They have no salt added, which all the liquid from the can, that's like where all the salt is, so I always drain all my beans anyway. But it has no salt added, and it has a non-BPA lining. So that's why I like to get my beans from here. I think I tried Alfredo, but I want to try cheddar. They know how to make um, it taste like cheese. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I hope I should get this here away from Trader Joe's. I'm trying to remember the price, and I think Trader Joe's is five.
now we're in Trader Joe's to get everything else that I need for the week. So come on, let's go. Love their hash browns. I always get them for, for breakfast and stuff. I just had them so. They have vegan mochi. <laughs> I've actually never seen vegan mochi until now and it's matcha flavor. So yeah, it's okay. Frozen strawberries. And I already bought mango, so all I need is the frozen strawberries. Avocados and teeny tiny ones are like a much better deal because they're cheaper you get more of them. There's like six in here. So I used to get pita bread to make vegan pizza with my um cheese that I just got. Hey guys, we are done shopping for today. I got everything I needed from Trader Joe's and Whole Foods and I got it for only under $70. So thank you guys for coming with me. Thank you Veggie Meat House and make sure to follow me at underscore Foxy Vegan on Instagram. Bye! Have a nice day!